What's up, cooks? It's Wednesday. I have a mystery seven quart KitchenAid stand mixer. Um, you ask why it's a mystery. It was refurbished on eBay, and I don't know if it's an AC seven quart or a DC motor Proline seven quart. I don't know what this is. Um, the picture look like the Proline, but I'm thinking maybe it isn't. So the model number, I can't tell because it's both, right? So we're going to take this out of the box and see. This one is, says black crinkle is the color. Um, yeah, so we have a seven quart KitchenAid stand mixer that we're going to figure out what this is. So welcome. It's What's Up Wednesday and it's stand mixer time. So out of all the KitchenAid stand mixers that I have, I don't have a seven quart. I don't have a pro line. I have Classic Plus, KitchenAid Artisan. I have the KitchenAid Pro 500, the Pro Professional 5 Plus. I have the Pro 600. Well, you have three five quarts. You got an Epicurus. Five, you got the 500, but then you've got the 5 Plus and some other 5. Yeah, I have a Professional 8D. Yeah. And I have the Commercial 8. So, oh, and I have the mini. I just and got mini. the mini. There's the mini right there. Yeah. Um, so KitchenAid has been dropping a bunch of refurbished stand mixers on eBay. And the prices have been absolutely incredible. I got the mini over there for $139. Well, they dropped a bunch of seven quart stand mixers. And um, I jumped on it. It was like $269. Picture looks like it's the pro line because it has the silver knob on the control level. But I'm thinking they've brought out this new seven quart that has an AC motor instead of a DC motor. And I know you're going to ask, what's the difference between the two? The main difference I know is the DC motor is a lot quiet than the AC motor. The AC motor is like the pro 600. The DC motor is like the commercial eight. Might have better speed control. Maybe. Yeah. Will I return this if it's not a pro line? I don't think so. <laughs> I think I'll keep it. Uh, this is a black, just like the mini. Um, I don't know why it says black crinkle on it. I've never seen that before. So, uh, hey, right? Um, I know people who have gotten ordered seven quart mixers and they came and, oh, it's like a, a mat. So, I was under the impression that the silver knobs was the pro line and the black knobs were AC and the silver knobs were DC. And I'm seeing silver knobs. So I don't know what this is. Silver knobs. Silver knobs. Here's the coded dough hook in the city, right? <laughs> oh, well. This <laughs> box just came on open. I guess this means I can't really return it if I don't like it. So... That's pretty pathetic. Oh my god. It's a beauty though. It's a beauty. Look at that. Look at that knob on there. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's a beauty. Whoa! I see an NSF. Uh, NSF? I see an NSF stainless steel whisk in there. Hmm. Uh. So here is the paddle. In there. Something stuck. Let's just get the weight off. It. Whoa! Okay, I got it. I up. It's up in the air. See so if okay. you can pull it. Ow! Don't hit his face. 
it is a stainless steel whisk and it does say on the top NSF. Ooh, Ooh this is a beauty. Oh. This is a beauty. Oh my gosh, it's matte black. It's got this very beautiful, oh my gosh. This is a looker. It's a looker. Seven quart bowl. Wow, oh my gosh. The bowl is unusually heavy for one of these KitchenAids. Whoa. Okay, I got out some mixers. Why not? <laughs> so I have the new seven quart. This is a Pro 600, and this is the KitchenAid Mini. Um, so this is a 3.5, a six quart, and a seven quart mixer. So what we're gonna do is I have a little sound meter here. We're gonna see how these sound. Disclaimer, not calibrated for inter entertainment purposes only. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Let's go with what I think is the loudest is the uh, Pro 600. We have the seven quart. I'm gonna turn it back down to 80. Eighty mi eighty minus four. Seventy-six. And the KitchenAid Mini. Eighty plus one. This is a DC. This is a known DC motor. This is a known AC mo motor, and this is a questionable AC motor. And it is actually the quietest. So I'm pretty shocked because I thought this one was going to be as loud as this one. Um, this one was actually not even as loud as the Mini. That's crazy. Um, so you ask, is the non-proline seven quart stand mixer going back? The answer is no, right? That was 97. 97. So I was even louder than that. <laughs> um, the seven quart, well, I haven't used it yet, but, uh, preliminary, the seven quart is now a member of the Amy Lerner Skook family. <laughs> I like it, and um, hmm, I only paid two hundred sixty-nine dollars for it, so there's that too. So what's up? It's Wednesday, cooks. We have the brand new seven quart KitchenAid stand mixer. We have the KitchenAid Pro Pro Professional six hundred Pro six hundred, and we have the KitchenAid Artisan Mini right here in the house. And the sound test is saying that the seven quart was, wasn't as loud as these two. So I hope you have a great Wednesday and um, I hope you enjoy this look at this new mixer. Seven, mini, and Pro 600. The person coming is a loud mixer. What does it go down to when I turn that off? Well, I have to knock it down from the desert right there. So go ahead. So right now we're on like 80 whatever, so go ahead.
Wow, that post 600 is loud.